Max from BFD Systems and today we're testing a 2400 size flat octocopter. Uh, this thing is fairly large. It's about uh, 2400 millimeters from motor to motor. Uh, if you were going to go from like a straight line across, it's just under 8 feet across, just from motor to motor. Uh, the propellers we're using on this are 30 inch. Uh, we're using uh, P80 motors from T-Motor. They've been pretty excellent. This is really our first test. We've just done some hovering. Now we're going to put some more batteries on and uh, kind of cruise around. This is right now we're testing with 16,000 milliamp tattoo batteries. When it's in operation, it's going to be using 22,000 uh, tattoo plus batteries. Uh, so where now we have it's a 12 vest setup. So we have series, series, and then parallel, and then the same thing on the second deck here. Uh, it flies really, really well. Super, super stable. Uh, pretty efficient because all the props are on top. We normally do a coaxial, but this is used for agricultural experimentation and package delivery, so we had just have the props on top. This payload will be uh, about 40 kilos, and we're doing some experimentation right now on flight times. We're calculating about 30 minutes uh, when we have the full-size batteries on here, uh, but this is still the initial test. But because it's such an impressive uh, aircraft, we want to take some video and photos during the initial stages. Right now we're using the aircraft with a A3 Pro. There's still some experimentation about what flight controller would be best for agricultural spraying. So we've been testing a lot of different things and that will probably end up changing. But for right now it's A3 Pro. Uh, it's a Lightbridge 2 controller so we're flying this massive drone with what looks to be exactly like a Phantom or Inspire controller. Um, this is uh, for ease of use for the end user to have uh, waypoint flying and everything like that also has all your telemetry here which is really nice. We have a run cam that's running on there just as a pilot cam. You can kind of adjust it up and down a little bit. Right now it's straight ahead and this is a standard def camera um, that's transmitting through the light bridge. So it's a digital signal, really clear. You got really good range of this um, and this kind of gives you all your telemetry. If you have, this is not a, uh, this is not a connected to Wi-Fi and doesn't have 3G, but if you had a 3G um, or Wi-Fi connection you to have a Google map overlay. You can also like cache a Google map overlay. Um, so like I said before this aircraft is going to be tested for agricultural uses, a package delivery, uh, or anything else that you need to lift that's pretty heavy. So let's take it first thing.